بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أما بعد أي الله بت في الله إمام بن باز was asked some of the youth think that non-Muslims residing or coming to Islamic countries should be treated harshly according to the Sharia therefore some of them make it lawful to kill them or steal from them if they see something they dislike from them the Imam as Salafi said it is not permissible to kill a non-Muslim resident or protected visitor that entered into the country protected nor kill those who are sinful or transgress against them instead they should refer whatever sinfulness that they do to the Sharia ruling and to what the Muslim government sees as a fit punishment and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and protect us from extremism Amin Ya Rabbil Alameen then the Shaykh was asked uh, what if there is no Muslim government the Imam of Ahl Sunnah in this time responded if there is no Sharia judge then only advise them advise the government in goodness and cooperate with them until they rule by Allah's law as for taking the law into his hands by commanding or prohibiting executing and hitting people then this is not permissible. However, cooperate with the authorities in righteousness until they govern the people with Allah's Sharia. If they do not, then it is an obligation to advise them. It is an obligation to direct them to good and prohibit evil with that which is good. This is an obligation. Allah says, fear Allah as much as you can. Because prohibition by hand by fighting or hitting will cause a greater evil and more wickedness without any doubt to anyone who keeps up with these affairs and understands them. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil.